This is not a woman sitting on a beautiful mountain side. And these are not beautiful pictures from deep in the ocean. In fact, a picture of Tom Cruise that popped up on our feeds in social media last week were not real either. All of these images have been generated using artificial intelligence tools. While there are dozens of artificial intelligence tools doing rounds, helping people write, helping people research, and helping people think more quicker and be more creative, but these same artificial intelligence tools can be used to mislead people out there. And it's so difficult to know whether a picture popping up on our social media feed is real or not. People who are frowning suddenly are smiling. A fake Pentagon blast causes a market cap swing of $500 billion. And presidents who are standing are suddenly kneeling. So yes, you would be correct to question here, what is even real anymore? Of course, fake images have been around for a while. You and I have seen them on our feeds. But with the emergence of AI tools like Midjourney, DALI, DeepAI, creating these images has just become so much easier and quicker. So this is how an AI tool like Midjourney works. Insert a command to Midjourney and ask it to create an image. And within a matter of seconds, voila, these are the results. As interesting as these AI tools are, but with big national events coming up, like 2024 elections, AI tools can be used to mislead millions out there. So here we have curated a few tips for you that'll help you differentiate between what is a real image and what is an AI generated image. Take a look at this image. At first glance, you wouldn't see anything wrong with it. But when you zoom in, you understand that this model has only three fingers. As of now, AI tools struggle with details of human anatomy. But if you zoom into images in the highest possible resolution, you can spot inconsistencies. In landscape images, it can be difficult to spot differences. So when you see pictures with human figures in them, pay attention to body proportions. AI tools tend to create errors which you can easily spot with attention to detail. So in first glance, the picture of Pope Francis and Balenciaga looks well in fashion, right? But here, you can zoom in and spot that one of his fingers is missing. Or in this image, his left hand is proportionally longer. Common AI-generated images have issues like too many teeth or deformed glasses. Cues that you can look out for are images that look smoothened out or glossy. And check if the background of the image looks deformed. Next, find the source of the image. To track the source of the image, you can use the comment section of the image. Or you can also try Google reverse search, which will help you find out the source of the image. Or you can also use softwares like Hugging Face, where you can upload an image and understand whether an image is AI generated or not. So it is sort of a given that with time, artificial intelligence tools are only going to improve and it'll be more tough for you and me to spot differences between a real one and an AI-generated one. But while that happens, all we can do is hope that humans will also create tools which will help us debunk misleading images.